I sing a lot of spirituals because in Scotland, it's really American music. We listen to Celtic music, they always ask me to sing the spirituals. Because to them, they have such a connection. The Celtic music to them is so strong in their, in their own everyday world, and they feel the spirituals were written about the same way. They were for people who were really struggling to get through everyday life. And when you think about where the uh, African Americans were at that time, and how they must have felt, they did not have a life. They weren't thought of as cattle. Now you are going to be with that man and you are going to have those children. And when I feel that it's my time, I'm going to take those children because they're healthy, good little kids. And they're very, very, very strong. And we're going to take them and sell them over to, you know, 100 miles away from you. You'll never see him again. And now he's done. I don't know that he's so, such a good breeder. So we're now going to put you with that one. I can't imagine that. Yet these people kept their faith. They went out in the fields and they sang about God and they thanked God for being alive and having the chance to know Jesus Christ because one day, someday, God was going to take them home. And this particular story really meant a lot to them because Joshua and all the followers had nothing either other than their faith. And they wrote a song that really encapsulates what we can feel if we just don't give up fight. Don't lose faith. And I'd like to share it with you. And I invite you to clap along. I invite you to get into it because the spirit of God is in that story. And I just hope that I can convey that spirit through this song. Tumbling down. <laughs> 